I'm it. And we are our Family, family Grace, Grace Games. Games. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And we are back. We're back. We're back. Another episode? Yes, yes. Another <laughs> episode. You know, every week we try to come out. So we, we try to come out and hey. do different things. And, you know, we try yeah. to do, you know, a little here and there. Have an interview <laughs> here and there. Do a little something here. So, you know, we just, so, we just, we do variety of stuff. So. Yes. This week. Uh, we decided to let me give you guys a list. Yes, yes. This week is it's exciting week. It's like because this week we learn what twenty games Starla really, really like in twenty twenty one. Yes, hard twenty games that get. is on Starla's love list. Yes, it was a hard, hard list. Family, I tried to tell her. Let's do ten. Mick, I can't do ten. I said 15, can't do 15. What, Starla? 20. I said 20? Yeah, the most I can narrow it down to was 20. I just couldn't go. I said, can you rank them? No. She said, I can't rank them. I can't rank them. I told Mick, I cannot say I love one more than the other. These are just games that I like to go back to over and over again. So there are other games that I like. So if I've talked about liking this game before, but it didn't make this list, it's not that I like it any less. Mm -hmm. I just had to narrow it down to 20. And family, uh, I don't I don't even know what she picked. I do not even know. So it's a surprise to all of us. Yes, yeah, so he wanted me. me to keep it a secret. They want to know. They want to so know. So he does not know. know. So yes. we will all go through this together. Yes, we will. And we'll see the yes, look on his face. Yes. He had yes. a few speculations on things that he just knew I would be think, on my list. I think I know what's going to be on there. I think. So anyway, we will be back with Starla's list of favorites for now. For now. <laughs> 20 favorites for now. Yeah. Right after a word from our sponsor. KTBG, let's do it. Kids Table Board Gaming. Making casual games for the serious gamers and serious games for the casual gamers. Publisher of Fossilus, Wreck Raiders, Haunt the House, their upcoming game Creature Comforts, and many, many more. Visit kidstablebg.com to see a complete catalog. Yeah! KTBG. There we go! <laughs> hey, I, I do want to just throw out, okay. since we love KTBG, okay. they have their sister company, mm -hmm. Burnt Island Games, has a uh, Kickstarter going on oh. for the, the prequel mm -hmm. of uh, the game that we have in the heart of the Mountain King is the oh. Fall of the Mountain oh, King. Wow. Okay. So just want to let you know, you know, they got a little kickstart out there, and, and everybody's really excited about that one. So, yes. hey, KTBG and Burnt Island Games doing some stuff. They doing stuff. They doing some stuff. <laughs> yeah. So doing now some it's stuff. time for the weight loss journey. <sighs> so yes. as yes. you can see, I yes. am all she smiles. Family, she did she did a thing. She did a thing. Last week she it was a, a horrible week because I yes. I went up yes. and I was so devastated. Yes. Well, I, I was Woo. devastated, but I knew why, because I'm working from home now. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't go downtown like I used yeah. to. But now we've started walking. Yes. And so Mick and I and Grant, we walked a lot. We we have a, a cool neighborhood park mm -hmm. in our neighborhood. Mm -hmm. And it's really cool. I don't know why we weren't walking it I before. Well it was winter. Yeah, it was winter. Now we it can go winter. out and go to the park and yeah. it's beautiful. We love right it. Right in the neighborhood. Right, right in the neighborhood. neighborhood. So yeah. we've been walking there. Yeah. And this week, when I talked to Linda at WW Studios, I went down 2.4 pounds. Look at that family. She was kicking it. 2.4. Now, family, for me, I was, I've been battling the cold. You probably hear a little bit, but I've been battling the cold. And I've been swigging a bunch of orange juice and a stuff. A lot of orange juice, sugar. Mm -hmm. So, so I did gain 1.4 pounds, mm -hmm. but I think I kind of, with all the walking and stuff, I lessened the hit on me. You did. You know, because it probably would have been three pounds or four pounds. Yeah, but, you know, he you was know. drinking orange juice and then getting soups, which has a lot of sodium. You know, and it's not that we have a strict diet per no, se, no. but when you deviate and go too yeah, far into yeah, the orange yeah. juice world. <laughs> well, I, I, I'll try to do what my mama and them give me. You know, yeah, when she gives me, you know, orange yeah. juice 
and and you know soup. soup, and then I was yeah. doing all those uh, cough drops and yeah, stuff. So that, that's all you know points. Yeah, you know? that yeah. just kind of killed the whole balance yeah. of the diet that we're on. Yeah. So, but I'm, week, I'm I'm getting better though. I'm yeah, getting better. Next week we're gonna better. do better. Yeah, because we're gonna keep watching. Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna do better. I'm gonna keep do better. Up in our game out there, and we want to say. Uh, we're going to miss Linda. She's yes. one of our counselors yes. at WW Studios. She's yes. going to retire. Yes. And it was difficult for us to say bye. She's got to say awesome. bye. She's been awesome. Since yeah, day been, one, yeah, yeah. she is there every week when we come in. Yeah. So, Linda, we're going to miss you. Go miss you, Linda. We love you now. We love you. Yeah. All right. So, what's up now? Now it's time for working. My new stories. Yeah, let's do, let's do this. I don't have much, family. I don't have much. I don't have much. But. One of our favorite publishers, mm -hmm. Keymaster Games, yes. who made parks, parks that we really do adore. Mm -hmm. we, we really like it. Well, they're coming out with a new game, and that new game is coming June 20th, 2021, okay. and it's going to be exclusive for Target stores. Oh. So they're going to mass market, y'all. Okay. And the game is called Trails, oh. a parks game. So it's like an offshoot of. Parks it's kind of a, a kind of a, a kind of friendly version. made. It's kind of a, mm. a kind of you know real kind of mass market mm. you know parks and trails because you're still mm. going on the trails, mm. still looking at that beautiful art they have. So it's it's gonna be cool. I think well, it's gonna be a nice really gateway game. Even yeah. though parks is kind of gateway, kind of, but this one's gonna be gateway. Okay. You know, or welcoming or whatever y'all yes. want to say. But you know, I think this is gonna be really cool. You know, to really get people into the hobby yes. and really liking, you know, how beautiful these games can be. Because, yes. you know, Parks was beautiful uh, and this one is beautiful too. Yes. So I'm really excited to see I what you're going to do. Yeah, I'm excited. Because we're going to get one. We're going to get one. We have to. We're going we're gonna to get one. Uh, let's see. And then now, my second thing okay. is that we're big fans of Red Raven Games mm -hmm. and Mr. Ryan Lockett and his Ryan beautiful Ryan. games. Above and below, near and far, near and far, mm -hmm. Rome, yes. uh, you know, Albion. We love the world of Arzium. Uh, uh, we love the land and the world of Arzium. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's so diverse, yes, it is. and it just brings you in, yes, and we love I, that. I love the story. Part yeah, the of it. story. The stories. I mean, that's yeah. so creative. It, yeah, it's, it's a very unique game because we don't have anything else. Like no, we don't have nothing like that, and, and it I just keeps it. going. And I, I wanted it to keep going. I said, I hope it doesn't stop because you know he came up with Sleeping Gods, mm -hmm. and that's not part of that world. No. And I said, Oh no, maybe he's leaving it. But to my surprise. He came, uh, uh, Red Raven Games came out with a trailer. They came out with a trailer, y'all. A trailer. That's how you do it. Yeah, and they came out with a trailer. So now in pre-order right now on Red Raven Games website, they have the new game in the world called Now or Never. Ooh. Now this game is still in the world, but it's a hundred years after all after near and far mm, okay. so it's a hundred years into this world and it got some bad stuff going on and you gotta you know work with it but now this game is more economic where you're building up a village okay and it's gonna be i would like that uh, it's I, gonna I be cool economics, yeah, you like economics so. and building a city yeah. so you're building this yeah. village so yeah. I, i'm really interested to see what's up with that mm -hmm. so that's on pre-order right now so i'm excited mm -hmm. about that real excited you know ryan lockett keep doing your thing man keep doing your thing now, the last thing I got is that Board Game Geek is announced that they're going to have uh, their con, BGG con, uh, in November 17th to November 21st in Dallas, Texas this mm. year. So they're going to do it. They're going to okay. do a con. Okay. So that's, you know, they're getting ready for that. So that's really cool. Yeah, a lot of people so, are coming yeah. online for the fall. We, we're getting yeah. a lot of notifications of people that are rescheduling and putting things yeah. in the fall. Because you know, things are getting a little bit better. Now, you know, fall, that's, that's almost winter. That's winter. Well, I mean, uh, November, fall, that's winter. winter yeah. You know, because I mean, even in our state, we're almost 50% vaccinated. So yeah, that's almost. Pretty good. Yeah, mm -hmm. so that's pretty good. That's pretty good. So, and, and I do want to say, you know, uh, the one thing we want to say is that Happy Pride Month. Yes. Definitely. Happy yes. Pride Month. And to all of our friends yes. and family, you know, in the queer community, we love y'all, we support y'all, and we're here for you. That's right. Because the one thing that we always preach is diversity and inclusion, and that's for everybody. Everybody. Everybody, everybody. everybody needs to be at the table. Mm -hmm. Not only at the table, but creating, mm -hmm. publishing, 
and getting games out the door. Yeah. You know, everything. Yeah, I agree. You know, everything. I so agree. that's what we like. We want to say happy Pride Month and love y'all. Yeah. Love y'all. And then the next thing, one more thing, one, one more thing, thing one, one more thing. thing. <laughs> I've seen in the you know in the in the board game hobby from uh, publishers and stuff, big and small, that they're having issues with logistics mm -hmm. and shipping. Things are getting uh, you know expensive because of this pandemic. They're messing up stuff. Mm -hmm. People not getting their you know their package you know the games on time and stuff like that. Don't get mad, y'all. Yeah. You know things have happened. Mm -hmm. Don't get mad at folk. You know just be patient. Patient. We got tons of games out there. It is not a board game drought. Patience is a virtue. It's not, you don't, told me that. We got plenty mm -hmm. of games yes. to play. So yes. play your games, mm -hmm. play some old ones that you haven't played in a you while. Go visit some yeah. old stuff. I love doing but that. Chill out, y'all. You know, your game's gonna be there. Your game's gonna be there. Yeah. So that's what I want to say. So that's it for me. All right. That's it. So I'm excited. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. So next up. Ooh, ooh, <laughs> let's do this. Ooh, all right. Ooh. All right. So here 20, it is. 20. Okay. Yes. As yes. I said yes. previously, okay. Okay. this was so hard. Okay. Because okay. we've had so many games. And yes. I'm going to do this list. It's alphabetical order. Oh, you're going to do alphabetical yeah, order? I, okay. I, I just okay. could not find myself okay. ranking them. Let's do this. I could Let's not do this. rank. All right. So the first one on my list. All right. Here we go. Alphabetical order, everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Now, again, these are my okay. favorite okay. games. Okay. Come on. Come on. All right. Just All right. in 2021. Because okay. 2022. It can be different. It's gonna be and different. In this particular list, I have about seven new games that I've never mentioned as part oh, really? of my favorites before. Really? So there Ooh. are others that are on here that I've mentioned before okay. that if you watch the show, you know I love them. Okay. But then I have seven new ones. So Ooh. in 2022, Ooh. I Ooh. have a whole new list. We have a whole new but list. But right now, let's start with A. And the first one is Agricola. Oh, yeah. All creatures yeah. big and small. What? Yes. What about the big boy? Oh, no. Really? I like the little one. Oh, I yeah, like you do like that little one. Bulls. Yeah, you do like the little They're one. They're so yeah. cute. They have enemy bulls in the big one, too, but I like all creatures big and small. Because better. you don't have to feed nobody. That's true. You be having trouble that's trying to feed true. folk in the grip. I just like to worry about my enemy bulls. I just okay. like them. All right. Yeah, and okay. that's, that's Lookout Games, and yeah. it is a two player. Yes, it is. It is two -player. tile placement, worker placement. I mean, yeah, tile placement, worker placement. Yes, yes, yes. Lots of it's a lot of worker placement. And oh, I mean, we, we like, fun. I mean, I like a lot of two player games. Because yeah, you do. Yeah, we you play do. a lot of two player games. Yes, yeah. So, all creatures big and fall, small is my first okay, one. Okay, okay. Now, my next one. All right, what's the next now, one? Now, this one was a tough one. Oh, okay. And it's a new one to us. Okay. It may not be new to everybody else, okay. but we just got it, I think, in okay. 2020. Yeah, yeah. And that is Castles of Burgundy. Yeah, yeah. Love. Yes, yes. Love. That's Castles a good one. We're new to it, y'all. Even though it's a classic yes. and been out there, it's, it, we, we didn't we, get it to last We year. finally got into mm -hmm. it, and we love it. We do. And we I, love it, was it. A, it was a tough debate between Burgundy and Tuscany, oh, and you, then you the what? Castles of Mad King. You have Tuscany on there? It was a, it was a debate. Oh. I couldn't put all the castles, so yes. I went with Castles of Burgundy, okay. and that's by Aaliyah. Okay. One to four players. All right. It's a set collection, tile right. placement. That's a felt game. You know, worker placement. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Love Castles of Burgundy. Okay. Okay. Can't wait to play that again. Yes. Yes. We got to play that again. Yeah. Got to get on the yeah. table. Yes. Got to do that. So, yeah. next one, okay. another What's two that? player. All right. Chai T for two. Yes. That's a good one. And that's yes. by Steep yes. Games. Mm -hmm. It's a one to two player game. Card drafting, dice rolling, pick up and deliver, worker play. I mean, all the things I love. Yeah. Worker yeah. placement, a card draft. I just love all this stuff. Chi, I mean, I love chai. You love chai? I do love I'm the Because I'm surprised you don't have chai on No, I, I, okay. I, I, I couldn't put it. I can't. This was a hard thing to narrow yeah. down. So I couldn't put them all. So you like you like the more, the more I guess, more complicated version of chai. Because chai, because mm -hmm. the regular chai is kind of... Gateway it's, easy. It's kind of cool. It's tea, still it's still fun, but yeah. it's not that hard. Yeah. But chai tea for two. I that's a little love, strategy. I love chai tea for yeah, two. Yeah. I love the boats yeah. and all stuff. You have to get your stuff to the boat. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. And yeah. It's, you know, it's another two player game that you know you and I do a lot of two players. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. I love that one. Okay. So, so now, I'm wondering. I'm trying to wonder if you're gonna have something else on there. But keep going. Keep okay. going. Keep well, going. Well, my going. next one. All right. And I did this one. Okay. It, it kicked another game off the list, but I did this one because it is a fun family game. And sometimes, you know, we want, Grant loves this one. Oh. And I also said we can all play together. And that is Downforce. Downforce, Downforce, yeah. Restoration Games. Yeah. Two to six players. Downforce, I mean, you cool. got auctioning. Yes. You got bidding, racing, the cute Now, that's a family cars. game. It's that a family is game. a family game. It's a family game. game. And yes, I still is. love my family games. Yes. You know, yes. even though I've got quite a few two players on here, we still have family yes. games. Because yes. we like true. to play together. Yes, we do. We do. And I like we to, do. you know, drag Grant yeah. out whatever I can. <laughs> You know, so there you go. 
Ooh, yeah, yeah. Now, all right, the next okay, one. okay, okay. Five tribes. Of course. Yeah, now you that. guys know. I knew that. I love I knew that. Five tribes. Five tribes was gonna be on there no five matter tribes what. Five tribes is one of my favorite. That that's number one. It, that's really well, number no, one for it's, you. It's on my list. I love them all. I okay. Them all. All so right. this is from Days of Wonder. Yes. It's a two to four player. Yes. And what I love about Five Tribes is the Moncala mechanic. Yeah. That's one of my favorites. I absolutely love it. And but, and it's so crazy because. When I showed you that a long time ago, before we, you know, really was getting well, into yes, the hobby, you said, oh no, that's too much. It was, you it said, that's was too much. so scary. Yeah, it's too the much. The first time I saw the board yeah. set up with all the little colorful meeples, yeah. I was just like, that's no way to work. Yeah, yeah. And then you and saw then Rodney Smith. You're, you're moving stuff, and, and then there's King Rodney. <laughs> yeah, then King Rodney. Yeah, yeah. So, Five Tribes, one of my favorites. And again, it's the Mancala mm -hmm. set collecting, mm -hmm. in game bonuses. Yeah. You know, I just, I really love that game. And then even adding in the expansions. The expansions. Oh, man. Love the expansions. Yeah. You know, but it's just a game that if you see it from the beginning, yeah. it can kind of put you off because it's yeah. a lot going it's a on. Lot. It's a lot game. going on. But it's if once lot. you learn it, yeah. you love it. So yeah. it's one of my favorites. Yeah. My next one, you guys just heard us talk about this one. And it's a new one to my favorite list, and that's Fossilus. Fossilus. We just played it last weekend. I won. With with I, yeah, we I'm know. Sorry, I won. We know. And I, we know. We know. I love fossils and I with, love with the all new, the expansion. I love the new expansion. Yeah. I love the little ice crystals. Yeah, ice um, age. I, yes, yeah. and I love the scorpion because I got a chance to stop you from doing some things. With she, the bit me, she bit me, y'all. She bit me. I don't know. Fossils are I got one bit. of my favorites. Yeah, yeah. It's a good one. It's yes. a good one. And that's, and, and, yeah, that's a family game, that's too. That's a family. Solid family it's game. It's KTBG, solid. two to five players. Yeah. You got grid movement. You got yeah, a action solid, points. A and solid set family collection. game. Yeah. Set collection. Yeah. yeah, Grant played with us, so yeah. we enjoyed it. Yeah. Now, another one you guys have heard me talk about over what, what, and over. What you got? What you got? What you that got? That is the Great Heartland oh, my Calling Lord. Oh, Company. God. You love that game. It's classic pickup and delivery. You love that love game. this game. You love it. And this is by Dice Hate Me Studios. It is two to four players. And it's just hand management, pick up and deliver. That's so, it. it. It's, it's basically a pick up and deliver That's one it. on one. That's, That's it. it. Pick up and deliver one on one. I love it that you can take it with you because yes, it's you a can. small box. It travels and, and, well. And you can change up the different, you it, know, yeah. the, the, you can change it's up the a, map a variable, of it. Yeah, yeah variable, you can change setup. it up. Yeah. So I, I really love yeah. that game. We've actually Because you're good at it. You're, she's good at family. <laughs> and we've actually Woo! done a playthrough of that one. Yeah, you did. Love it. You did that. We did a playthrough. Now, yeah. this one may be a surprise for Mick. Okay. Imperial Settlers. No, no, because you yes. like that. You like that. I do. Yes. I do. Because you always play, what, what do you play? The, the I, I like to play the Egyptians. The Egyptians, yeah. So. Yeah, that's I, like my queen, y'all. My Egyptian <laughs> so, queen, y'all. Yeah, so I kind of fluctuate between Egyptians and Romans, yeah. but Imperial Settlers is a game that when we first got it, we played it over yes. and over. We beat it you to know, death. He yeah. wins, we and love I got to play again, so we I can win. It. Yeah. It's a great game. Pick up and uh, but, Imperial Settlers is by yeah. Portal Games, yeah. one to four players, yeah. card drafting, yeah. hand management, yeah. and some take that. The only thing I didn't like is too short. Because by the time you're ready to, you're gearing up all yeah. your stuff, and you got your resources, and you're building, and you got your, 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 your engine building, Yes, it's over. Yeah, by the time you wrap up, it's done. You're like, what? Yeah. But, but, but it's I, a good like, game. I like the game. Yeah, it's a good game. I it's like a good the game. game. So it had to be on my list. And that's yeah. one I don't talk about a lot. Yeah. In period yeah, settlers. you don't. You don't. All right, so now we're on to the ninth one on my list. Okay. And that is a new one to us. Yeah. And that is Kohaku. Oh, you really do like that one, huh? I like it because, like, that like I said before, we talked about this one before. Yeah. I, it's so relaxing. Yeah, it is. And sometimes we get in these games and you know, you get hyped up because you're yeah, going to win. Yeah, yeah, Even yeah. with Koako, whether you win or lose, you should be relaxed when you play this game. You should. It's so Because it's just the, the, you know, the koi, yeah. you know, the, the fish are nice looking. Yeah. Even the, the objects and stuff yeah, are nice looking. I mean, looking. The, the colors in it, yeah. the acrylic tiles, so serene. And this is by Gold Seal Games. Yeah. One to four players. Yeah. It is tile placement and drafting. That's and it. all you're doing is just placing. You know, you're just getting easy. two tiles and very easy. You know, and just to, you're just trying to build your own little koi mm -hmm. pun, trying to make points. Yeah, you know, trying to put things. Easy. Oh, it's easy. Very easy to play. Easy to learn. It, easy to play. It just yeah. relaxes. And it's fast. It's fast. And yeah, when you put it on the fast. table, yeah. it's relaxing. Had to be on my list because yes. I don't want everything yes. to be combative. No, this one is really no. relaxing. Yeah, yeah. Now this other one we don't talk about enough, but it's another game that when we first got it, what we you got? played it all the time, and that is Lords of Waterdeep. Oh yeah. 
You you just you asked me the other day. I did want to play it. We gotta play it. Yeah, exactly. Cause you saw this. We we saw on uh, I think it was board game. It was on Facebook. It was Facebook. And I and saw a picture. A picture of this huge play mat mm -hmm. that have all the the expansions yeah. and everything. A huge play mat. With you know far far lords of water deep and yeah. she's and installer said Mick where can we get that I'm like okay let me find it. Like our board you doesn't know, look like that. What is this board? That's a huge one. That's a that's <laughs> a custom play mat. Like yeah, custom so play mat. After seeing yeah. that, now I've got this whole bug. I want to put lords of water. You want to play lords of water deep now? Yeah. Now, yeah. Lords of yeah. water deep is from Wizards of the Coast. It's yes. two to five players. Yes. Card drafting, set collection. Yes. Worker placement. Yes. Worker placement one oh one. That's Fun it. Game. That's it. Fun no, day. see, I gotta see if you're gonna have something else on there. Okay, okay. we're gonna see. We're gonna so see. Okay. now okay. the next okay. one, we're halfway okay. through my list. Okay, okay. Here's another one. Okay. And it's another one again. When we All got right. it, it was addictive. I wanna play it again. Yeah. yeah. And that is Oh My Goods. Oh, yeah. Oh my we goods. killed that one. Woo, we love, love that game. We love it. And we that is it. Lookout Games, two yes. to four players. Yes. It is hand management, set yes. collection, and press your luck. And also the multi-use cards that Multi you can, oh, you were kind of confused on that at first. Yes. And you're like, Mick, how can we? I said, it's multi-use. Your goods mm -hmm. is your money yes. too, and the buildings can be, you know, anything. You're like, what the? Well, you, you know, know so, yeah. I think sometimes games that confuse me in the beginning yeah. are, become the ones that I love the most. Yeah, yeah. And, and that's like, you know. Five tribes. Five tribes, you yeah. know, and then this one, oh my goods confused yeah. me in the beginning. And then it's like, oh, I, the light bulb goes off. And yeah, I'm like, yeah, yeah. Yes. And I don't like the light bulb going off because I start losing. I love it with the light bulb I start losing. I love like, it. Oh, man. Now, another one we just played okay. a few weeks ago, and that okay. is Quacks of Quidlinburg. Yeah. I knew that was going to be on your North list. North Star Games. Yeah. Two to four players. And this one is No, no. Now it's CMYK. Oh, C is the new Yeah. I always get the publishers wrong. CMYK is the new publishers now. Yeah. CMYK. Yeah. And it is, you know, you're pulling stuff out of a bag. Yes. You know, it's press your luck. And the part I don't like about it right. is the catcher leader. She don't like the she don't Catch like the, the rat leader. tails, y'all. She don't like the rat tails because that he help me. It. it helps me. But that's why I don't like it. I don't want <laughs> you to have extra help. <laughs> but other than that, the game Woo! is awesome. Yeah. The board is yeah. adorable. You got a cauldron. It's going around. It's swirling, putting your little mm -hmm. ingredients in the cauldron. So you, you're getting different ingredients. You pay for them and you put them. I love it. Yeah. Love quacks. Yeah. And now my next one. Okay. Fell in love with this one at a con. I've talked about it before, and that is Quadropolis. Quadropolis, huh? Love Quadropolis. Yeah, Quadropolis. It's, it's, you know, you're yeah. building your little town. Your yeah, little city you love building town. I love that. Yeah. And Quadropolis is from Days of Wonder, yes. two to four players. Forgotten. It's been forgotten, y'all. That's an a awesome great game. game, and it's I forgotten. I mean, you just buy it for the little blue oh, translucent meeples. Fun game. And then the red translucent energy. Yeah. I love those little things. Uh, it's, it's, I think it's really been forgotten. I think so too. You know, it shouldn't be because they came up with one expansion, and then after that, it's, it is an awesome game. It's you awesome have not game. heard of Quadropolis? Look, Look it up, y'all. Look it up. Look it up. And Look it's it up. hand management, it's yeah. tile placement, set collection. It's it's got all the mechanics yeah. that you're familiar with if you play board games. You're gonna love it. And then it has a begin a, a beginner section, or kind of like just yes. a regular, section. and then like advanced and advanced. So, so it gives you so many options yeah. to play the game, it, and it's quick. It doesn't yeah, it take is. long. It don't take long. That's what I hate too. It don't take you know, don't take long. You're like, wait a minute, I got stuff I to do. Right. Yeah, I, I love this game. If you like, I said, if you haven't seen it, check out Quadrupolis. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Now definitely. another one that's a big family game. It's quick, fun, easy, and that is Roll for It. Mm -hmm. Calliope game. Yes, yeah, two yeah. to four players, and nothing about the dice rolling. Just dice rolling and, and putting, you know, trying to match the cards. The yeah. cards with the dice. Yeah, just that's match roll the cards. Yeah, to do. yes. You rolling can put the dice. This game out. Roll the, like you in Vegas, like you in Vegas. Yeah, you can put this game out anywhere. Anywhere. Anybody can learn it. It's quick learning and teach fun. anybody. You're gonna laugh till you cry. It's fun. Yes, your grandpa, your uncle, your grandma, yeah. you know, aunties. They can. They all. And can that's play what it. makes it they a favorite. I, I yeah. love that it's so versatile that anybody can learn it. Yes, and it's just a lot of it's fun. It's a lot of fun. A lot I of mean, fun. everything on my list, of course, is fun. And people gonna be hollering. It's gonna be hollering. It's yeah. gonna have. It's gonna be lots of fun, y'all. Lots, lots of fun. Of fun. Yeah. And roll for it. It's two to four. No, no, no. It is two to four unless you get the expansion. Expansion, then it can go. Yes, the it can go all the way to eight. Yes, yes. that's right. Yeah, go to eight. Yeah. Now another Not one. Not expansion, just get a, another copy. Another copy. Yeah, another right. copy. So yeah. another one I love is Skull King. Of course. Grandpa Beck's game. Of course. Yes. Yes, and we got the and we all we just purchased the uh, the new updated version of it. Yes, yes. We, did. we got that. And, yeah. and I love it because I'm a spades player. 
And play. Skull King to me is like Spades 2.0. Yeah, yeah. You know, Spades on acid. Yeah. On steroids, steroids. Steroids. Steroids, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's just trick taking. It's just trick taking. It is trick taking. With a complicated uh, scoring. Yeah, the scoring. The scoring is kind of uh, complicated, but not bad. Little, not bad. Not yeah. bad. You can learn it. You can learn it. You can learn it. If you're yeah. a spades player or a hearts player, you're going to have to really adjust your mind for the scoring. Yeah. But other than that, it's great. And it plays two to eight. So yeah. Yeah. Lots of fun. Lots of fun. Yeah. Lots Predictive fun. bidding. It's, it's a trick taking game. That's yeah. all it is. That's all it is. That is all it is. Now, yeah. another one, which is one of my favorites. Yeah. And this is Worker Placement 101, and that is Stone Age. I knew. See, I was wondering if you're going to have it on of there. Of course. I love Stone Age. Yeah, because you had, you had uh, Lord Water Deep on there, and I yeah, said, ooh, is she going to put Stone Age on there? Yeah, because yeah, I, okay. I didn't want to take them off just because right. of Worker Placement, because a lot of stuff I love is Worker okay. Placement. All right, all right. But I love right. Stone Age. Again, it's another one of these family games. Okay. It's another one when we first learned it, at least for me. Yeah. I didn't get it right away. No, it was kind of hard to. Yeah, I didn't get know, it right away. That was a long time ago. But that's because we were ago, yeah. so new. Yeah, we were so new to it. Yeah. To the hobby, yeah. But once you again, when the light bulb goes off, it's like, oh, I love oh, this. Yeah, and it was fun because you made me go find that. <laughs> yes, game. I did. I said, you I said, it, Mick, find, find it. it. I'm like, the okay. time, I think it was out of print or something. No, it was still in print a little bit. Okay, so now it's really hobby. hard to get, but you can get yeah. the, you know, the anniversary edition and stuff. But yeah, but yes, it was. I love yeah. Stone Age. That's Asmo D, two yeah. to four players. No, it was hard for your your uh, best friend Marnie to get it. Yes, yeah, it was, yeah. It. That was a few years ago. Yeah. It was hard for her. Yeah, but Stone Age, like I said, is worker placement one hundred and one. Yeah, it is. Set collecting. It is. It's just it's a wonderful game. Yeah, it is. Lots of fun. Lots of fun. And yes, you and the stinky cup. Yeah, the stinky cup, y'all. It doesn't bother me. Yeah, the, it's a stinky it, cup. It doesn't bother me. It's a stinky it, cup. Don't smell the cup. Yeah, but you got it. You know, it's like, like you know, <laughs> you, <laughs> you want to stink. You, you want to have to do that. You want to no. do that. You know. Now. This is another game okay, that I what love. What you got? What you got? I mentioned it several times. Okay. It's the first game that I purchased myself. Yes. It, yes. Yes. And I know I it is. I bought it. Yeah, I know it is. Just because of the box art. Yeah. And that is suburbia. And now I changed it. And then they changed it. <laughs> and I'm gonna tell you now, uh, Bezier Games. If it had the box art cover that it has now, I would never have looked at it. Really? No, because it looks boring. Oh. And I'm, I'm just gonna be straight up. Yeah, Love the game, yeah, Bezier, but yeah. this blue box art you did this yeah, time, yeah. it's boring. I like seeing the people on the cover. It made me want to know what are these people trying to do? Yeah, like, trying to move to the suburbs. Yeah, what, what's, what's the theme behind this? What's the story yeah, behind yeah, this? Yeah. It's just a blue box. I, I don't. Whoever did the box art, sorry, I don't like it. Yeah, yeah. But I do love the game. Love the game, beautiful. Even the, the, the upgraded game. version of oh, it. Love the game. You know, the tiles and stuff, beautiful. Suburbia beautiful. is uh, tile placement. Building a city. You're building a city. Building a city. You know, so it's and a resource management. Resource too. management. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and it is wonderful players. Yeah. It's a wonderful game. Suburbia. You know, I knew that was going to be on the list. need some new cover art, but otherwise, <laughs> we're going away from that. Now, here's one that's an old game. I think yeah. it's the oldest one on my list. But it's new to us because we only discovered it maybe six years ago, yeah, seven years ago. Yeah, yeah. And that is Survive, Survive, Escape from Atlantis. Beautiful family game. And that is from Beautiful Stronghold game. Games, yeah. two to four players. Beautiful family game. Survive yeah. is the game that if Grant has friends over, I want to pull this out. Yes. We've done this with Grant's friends. They love it. It's fun. You're going to laugh until you cry. Yeah, easy to play. You know, throwing people off your boat or letting your boat leave without I'll get people. get people get eat up. Let the sharks get them. Trying to save your people so they <laughs> won't get eaten let the, up. Let the sharks get them, like keep people off the, <laughs> the boat. Y'all try to make, kill my folks. Leroy, I don't want to try to kill Leroy. No, you make the boat capsize so Mick can get eaten by sharks. Now, what? And that, that's that's my that. people, not me. That's, that's my people. What the fun is. Don't don't eat up my people. But that's the fun, laughing at you trying to get away from <sighs> the sharks trying to swim in with the dolphins. <laughs> so right, meet them that. dolphins. Meet them dolphins. But yeah, yeah. love survive. Yes. If you can get the copy, get it. Get it's it. awesome. And get the expansions that bring it up, you know, the player count a little bit more. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Now, we're almost at the end. And another one yeah. that was hard for me the first time I saw it, oh, it, gave, it gave me a headache. Oh, I know what that is. And that is Terra Mystica. Yes, Terra Mystica. I was, I was though, wondering, I asked you last night, I said, I know you got Terra Mystica on there. Well, I didn't tell you. I know. You didn't I tell didn't me, but I knew. I knew. Terra I Mystica, the first time we saw it, it gave me a headache. Yes, that's a heavy one. I, I, heavy I literally one. like, this thing hurts my head, but then yeah. I was so determined to get it. Yes. I was just like, I'm not going to let this game beat me. I got to beat this game. Yeah. And Terra Mystica is by Feudaline Spiel. Yeah. It's yeah. a two to five player game. Beautiful. But we love y'all. We love y'all. Can't love pronounce y'all too good, but we, we love y'all. And it's variable player powers. Yeah. You've got different tracks you're going up. Income. Income. Yeah, I mean, that's resource management one on one. Like, you, you got to try to, 
you know, control your resources, you try to get more people, you know, yeah. it's like, whoo. But I'm not going to lie, Terra Mystica, if, if you're still kind of new to this hobby, it's a tough one. Yeah. But yeah. if you're determined to learn the game, yes. you're going to have so much fun once you do. Yes. I, I love Terra Mystica. And it, it will open up so many other games out there for you that are a little bit harder and a little bit heavy. But it will open up. Yes, it you know. will. Yes, it will open up. Because yes. it, it was something else. Now you got to do the gear project now. Yeah. You got to do gear project. You got to do it. You got to do it. I don't know. The We've theme, been sitting up on our shelf of shame, our shelf of opportunity too long. It has a, the theme didn't grab me. That's why I haven't rushed to do but it. But we got to try it, though. I like the original. We got to try it. Well, we've been saying that for a while. We got to yeah. try it, though. We got to try anyway, it. Anyway, Terra yeah. Mystica. Yes. That's the one. Yes, yes. Down last but not least. Okay. And I know okay. this is going to be a surprise. All right. I picked Ticket to Ride, okay. Pennsylvania. Yeah, I knew that. Pennsylvania. Yeah, because you like that one. You I always do. say you that's the one that you love. Now, Ticket to Ride is Days that's of Wonder. That's the one you say you love. It's two to five players. Yes. And this is with the UK map, the United Kingdom Yes, map. with the UK map. So, I know I could have picked a bunch of Ticket to Rides, but totally. this one I love the most just because of the stocks. I love the set collecting of this one. Yeah. It's a little bit different, and I love that Ticket to Ride does that. They, they'll add a little extra, yeah, little yeah. mechanic to the game yeah. to make it different. But you really like the stocks no, thing. No, I like yeah. the stocks thing. So Pennsylvania, yeah. I think out of all of my Ticket to Ride or our Ticket to Ride game, mine, our Ticket to Ride games, Pennsylvania's got to be my favorite. Okay. All right. I knew that, though. That's it. I knew that. Well, that's not now, now, wait a minute. Wait a minute now. What happened to Istanbul? I know. I purchased Istanbul. But and you said you like that I, I took, I, Okay. Just like we talked about, I yeah. couldn't. If I put every game that I love, we'd be at list, fifty. We'd be at fifty or sixty. <laughs> I mean, I mean, you told me to stop. Yeah, stop at twenty. You don't know. We had he told me you got to take it down to ten. I'm like, I can't. She couldn't do it to ten, y'all. I, I she couldn't, couldn't do take 10. It to ten because then I would just leave too many games yeah. out that I want to share with everybody because these games are really something that I go back to over and over. Yes, she does. And when I don't have the time to go back to it, I'm telling Mick, Mick, we got to play this. You yeah. know, we, we get so many new games to play that I don't get a chance to go revisit. Mm -hmm. And the ones that I gave you today, these are games that I want to revisit. Yeah. And if yeah. I haven't revisited them lately, then they're on my list to revisit. Yeah. Because yeah. I, I get tired of yeah. sometimes going to the new all the time. I want to go back and see these games. Yeah, yeah. Because I love yeah. them. Yeah. And that's why I couldn't rank them. There is no number you one. You couldn't rank them at no, all. No, I'm not ranking them. Well, I'm going to tell you that I know Five Tribes is at, is either one, two, or three. It's, it's definitely in the and top Suburbia three. And Suburbia is either one, two, or three. <laughs> they have the top three. And there are yeah. other games I know that people say, why didn't this make the list? Because she loves this one. Yeah. I had to bring it down to 20. Yeah. This yeah. is it. Well, y'all y'all know there's no co-ops on there. So you know there's no co-ops. No co-ops. No co so next week. Yes. We're going to hear from Mick. Yes, me. Now, you're going to get your list down to 10? No, it was 20. You did 20, I'm going to do 20. Well, you don't want to try to get me to go No, to no, 10. I'm going to do 20. You did 20, I'm going to do 20. Right. You'll see. It's going to be right. hard to No, do it's not because I know what I like and I'm going to put them all on there. I might even, no, I'm not going to even promise I'm going to rank them. I'm no. just, no. Oh, you go ahead and try to rank no. them. No, oh, no, no, <laughs> no. Mm -mm. See, see how that works? No, I'm no. Just, you're sitting there, I'm fighting mm -mm. with myself. I Let's know, you fight. I one, I had, so I said, no, I just couldn't do it. It yeah. was too, it was yeah. too difficult. Because it's a lot of them that I'm like, why should you put that on the list? And that, that was my first one, yeah. Istanbul. Yeah. Because you love that one. I, you were I telling me, I want to play Istanbul. You I know. know, but I, I couldn't find space for it. Yeah, yeah. I couldn't. I had to stop. I mean, I should have had a Catan on the list. There's several Catans yeah, I, I like, but that's what, I couldn't. That's what really shocked me. I couldn't do it. Not even a Catan no. on there. No. These are and, you, and you asked me about a Catan, you know, the other night. I like, know. Mick, uh, and I was like, really? No Catan. I had to narrow it down. I mean, here we go. If I kept going, I would have been at 50 yeah. or 60. Yeah, that's true. That's true. You know, that's you got to think of a, a gaming collection. What do we have? I don't know. I don't mean how many hundreds. Yeah, we got, how we many got hundreds a lot. do we have? We got, we got, you know, so, we got, we got a few. We yeah, got a few. So it's yeah. hard to bring it down yeah, it to even 20. It is. But I do think that these are worth mentioning because yeah. these are ones that I just want to go back to as much as possible. Because another one I would throw out there, Clank. I love Clank. I couldn't put it on my list. Wow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wow, okay. Yeah, I, I okay. couldn't. I love it, but I couldn't yeah. get it. Yeah, okay. All right. All right, everybody. Okay. That's All right, it that's it. List. That's it. So be sure to check yeah. us out next week to see what Mick does. Yeah, see, see what I well, do. How yes. well his list is. Yes, check me yeah. out. <laughs> check <laughs> me out. I'm not going to tell her. I'm not going to tell her. No, I don't, I don't want to know. I'll be not surprised. I'll be I'm surprised. So, so, Starla, where can they find us out in this social media you know, wilderness out there? <laughs> Where you can find us at? Well, if you're looking for our family plays games, we are on Facebook, yes, Instagram, yes, Twitter, yes, right here on YouTube, right here. Sometimes on the dice tower. Sometimes on the dice tower. 
And if you're in Omaha, Nebraska, yes. Yes. you can catch us on Cox Channel 22 on Saturdays at 8.30 p.m. and Tuesdays at 4.30 p.m. We're on the TV, y'all, locally, <laughs> locally, yeah. So if yes. you haven't got any OFPG merch, Check us out on Teespring. Come on, check us hey, out. The weather's warm. Yeah. T-shirts are in. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> you know, hey, you'll you be exercising, doing stuff, That's but just right. around the house, you need some OFPG gear. That's right. Yeah. All right, everybody, yeah. go sit for us this week. Hey, keep talking to us, commenting, letting us know what's going on. We love y'all. Always know that. Yes, we we do. love y'all. Have a great week. Bye. Bye.